Do You Know About Amphibians? by Buffy Silverman. What is an amphibian? Tadpoles swim in a pond. They wiggle their tails from side to side. The caption says tadpoles have long tails for swimming. Tadpoles change as they grow. What do they become? And the caption on this side is showing you that tadpoles grow legs. Frogs. They leap out of water and hop across the land. Frogs are amphibians. Toads and salamanders are amphibians too. It says a frog's long back legs help it leap on land and swim in water. Most young amphibians start their lives in water. Most adults live on land. All amphibians have backbones. You can see this frog's backbone under its smooth skin. Amphibians cannot make their own body heat. Their bodies get cold when the air is cold. They get warmer when the air is warm. They are ectotherms. And the caption just shows two frogs warm up on a sunny log. It says many amphibians live where it is always warm. This spadefoot toad lives in the hot desert. It stays cool by burying itself underground. Amphibians lay eggs. Spotted salamanders crawl in a forest on a rainy spring night. And the caption says some spotted salamanders have yellow spots. They find a pond. There they lay a clump of eggs. The eggs do not have shells. They are covered in a jelly. And the caption says a spotted salamander rests near its eggs. Toads also lay eggs. They lay them in long strings. Inside each egg, a tadpole grows. It says these are toad eggs. One toad can lay thousands of eggs at a time. Soon, tadpoles hatch from the eggs. The tadpoles eat tiny water plants. It says groups of tadpoles stay together and eat. Tadpoles swim together to stay safe. Fish, birds, snakes, turtles, and insects all eat tadpoles. And the caption shows, it says, this bird caught a tadpole. Male poison dart frogs guard their eggs. Tiny tadpoles hatch from the eggs. They wiggle onto their dad's back and he carries them to water. And it's showing you a male poison dart frog carries two tadpoles to water. Amphibians grow and change. An amphibian's body shape changes as it grows. The tiny tadpole hatches quickly from an egg and grows quickly. Its back legs grow first, then tiny front legs appear. Its tail disappears. This change is called metamorphosis. And the caption on the left just says, this bullfrog tadpole has grown legs. The tadpole changes in other ways too. Soon, it will eat insects instead of water plants. It grows a long, sticky tongue to catch flies. And it says the tadpole grows into a frog. It uses its tongue to catch a bug. The tadpole grows eardrums. What will it hear? Frog songs. Male frogs call to females in the spring. And the caption is just showing you, it says, can you see this frog's eardrum? Young amphibians breathe underwater with gills. This young spotted salamander has feathery gills. Soon the salamander's legs grow longer. The fin along its tail shrinks. Its gills disappear. Lungs grow. 
Then it breathes air with its lungs. It says this adult spotted salamander used to have gills. Now it has lungs and breathes air. A tiger salamander also breathes through its damp skin. It digs holes underground. The wet ground keeps its skin damp. And damp is when something is kind of wet, but not soaking wet, just a little bit wet. It says some amphibians always live underwater. Adult mud puppies swim in lakes and streams. They keep their bushy gills. And it says an adult mud puppy catches a crayfish underwater. Amphibians stay safe. Some amphibians stay safe by hiding below ground. Marble salamanders creep beneath logs. They hide there from their enemies. It says some amphibians blend in. Camouflage helps them stay safe. Can you spot the gray tree frog? The bright color of a golden poison frog warns hunters to stay away. The frog's poison makes animals sick. And it says stay away from this golden poison frog. How does the wood frog live in the cold winter? It hibernates. Water inside its body turns to ice. The ice melts in the spring. Then the frog hops away. It says a wood frog hides in the soil in winter. It comes out of hibernation in the spring. Fun facts. Legless wonders. Amphibians called caecilians have no legs. Caecilians look like worms. Their tiny eyes can only see light and dark. Sky high tadpoles. Some poison owl frogs carry tadpoles high into a tree. The father frog drops a tadpole in its own tiny pool of water in a tree trunk. The tadpole stays there until it changes into a frog. Giant salamanders. Japanese giant salamanders can grow longer than you. They grow for their entire lives. Who is the parent? It says match the young amphibian with its parent. So on the parent side, A is a bullfrog and it is the parent of the tadpole in picture number three. B is a mud puppy and it is the parent of number one. And C is a spotted salamander and it is the parent of the number two picture on the side that says young. Here are some glossary terms that the author thought we might need to know in order to understand what they're trying to teach us about amphibians. An amphibian is an animal with smooth skin that usually lives part of its life in water and part of its life on land. Frogs, toads, salamanders, and caecilians are amphibians. Camouflage. Coloring that helps an animal blend in with the things around it. Ectotherm, an animal whose body temperature changes when the temperature of its surroundings changes. Eardrum, the part of the air that vibrates to sound. Gill, a part of the body that some animals use for breathing underwater. Hibernates, spends the winter in a sleep-like state. When animals hibernate, they have a lower body temperature, breathe less often, and use little energy. Lung, a body part that some animals use to breathe air. Metamorphosis, changes in the form of some animals as they grow, and tadpole, a young frog or toad that has hatched from an egg.